common software you're going to encounter are either Aspen, Plus, and Hisis. They will model you agitation tank and so on. Comes from multiphysics, especially for temperature, momentum, and mass transfer concepts, such as maybe what's the temperature gradient, what is the velocity, what is the concentration, and so on. And SOLIDWORKS for dimensions and design of equipment. For example, Comsol Multiphysics will, you have your static mixer right here, and this might, I don't know, I mean, in this case maybe the concentration. Look, you have, let's say blue is one fluid, red is another fluid, and you can model each stage as they mix, and eventually they turn out to have the same color. Concentration, you have the same concentration, and that is what you want. First you have a concentration of five, and then a concentration of nothing, this might be maybe water plus, I don't know, a brine. You mix it and you go and finish with a final value of 2.5. Makes sense. You mix something about pure water and a brine, which is 30%. You will expect it to have something in between. So here it goes. And you can model this static mixture. It's awesome, especially if you are actually working with that equipment. Also, SOLIDWORKS, you may do that. I haven't used, personally, SOLIDWORKS for this type of applications, but I know you can use it. Also, this mixture or splitter, you can see here how they split. This is the A splitter designer. Also, this mixture, this is about velocities of forces, not about concentration. Aspen Heises will tell you either splitter or Mixture will tell you how many inlets, how many outlets, type of, uh, for example, the diameter of the tank, elevation, elevation versus ground. You can also add properties such as molecular weight, mass, heat transfer, density, and so on. It has plenty of data. Another mixture right here, HISIS. You have same, almost the same parameters. You got the, I think the most important parameter is diameter, elevation, and yeah, eventually you just need to click run and the flow sheet will tell you how they will uh, mix and maybe even time of mixing, the temperature uh, requirements or final temperature, and I think that's essentially what Aspen Heises will tell you. Of course, he will tell you the final composition. That's a nice thing. You just need to add stream number one versus stream number two, mix them, and you calculate. Well, you don't calculate. Click run, and Aspen will calculate for you the final composition. This was a free preview. You want to get full access? Go to my incompressible flow course. The link is in the description of the video. You will get all access. Not only that, you get a very straightforward uh, user-friendly interface so for instance you were analyzing or studying pumps you have it here the pump block and then you have the sections if you're for example studying the types of pumps you can go here and you have all the classes right here not to mention that you also have introduction and conclusion of every one of these so for instance if you were studying positive displacement pumps the video is right here you were studying positive displacement pumps in rotatory and reciprocal are also included here. Centrifugal pumps, which is a very important topic in this course, you have it right here.